What's up, YouTube, and what you know, my name is Domino with the Zero, and welcome to episode 35 of our Pokemon Reborn Let's Play, playthrough, whatever you want to call it. Um, in the last episode, we took on a Pulse Muck and the Team Meteor person, um, Solaris, alongside of um, <coughs> Amaria. If you want to check out that episode, which was extremely hype, make sure you hit the icon at the top of the screen. In today's episode, we have audio. Um, which we did not at the end of the last episode, and we are at Apophil Academy. So we're going to head back this way and take on some trainers. Uh, but if you're excited for today's episode of Pokemon Reborn, make sure you hit the like button down below. You subscribe if you're new, and let's get into it. As far as the audio goes, like I was saying, um, at the end of the last episode, we lost our audio when we got here. And um, when I went to look at my Reborn folder... Um, Part of the audio files were had been offloaded, um, so I had to re-download those from uh, from the cloud. The Pavel Beach is known for its dark sand, dyed in hue by the wind and ash from Pyrus Mountain. But yeah, so a quick restore, a quick just download of those, and everything was good. So here we are. Our goal is to get everyone to level 40, at least. But I do know that there's a gym here. I don't know how soon we take that on. I don't know what our levels are looking like. Why did that happen? I don't know, but that. Also, I forgot this thing was a Riolu and lower level than me. What else you got? Meditite? Uh, I was staying. How did I get hurt? That's annoying. I should have. Well, wait. No, never mind. I was about to say I should have faked out, but I was already in. Also, I feel like this music is really loud, but I hope it's not too bad. That's something I've kind of been experimenting with on a whole lot of my videos is just the level of the music. Uh, because, like, my brain sometimes tells me that it's too loud. But then when I watch other people's videos, like, let's say I watch Shofu's videos, um,. His voice and the game audio seem to be on like the same level, which I kind of like. So I'm gonna I'm gonna experiment with that. Um, and of course, you can always let me know what you think. This this is a really cool area. I do like this. We're kind of getting like like I've said, this game is really long. If you're watching this game and you haven't played it yourself, this game is really long. We are a long ways away from, I mean anything. I mean anything. Okay, good. Don't confuse me, please. Mucho gracias. Mucho gracias. Or is it muchas, muchas gracias? Mucho... Something gracias. Water ghost? Is poison not very effective on ghost? Oh, we did not. I did not check to see what level I should be evolving my mirror B. Let's do that now. Why do my Pokemon always hit themselves in confusion? Okay, uh, I'm gonna heal, and then I should be good to smack this thing with one more. The question is, do I want Hydro Pump? Or do I want to evolve at level 40? If I want Hydro Pump, I can stay until level 44. If I want... If I don't want Hydro Pump, then I can evolve at level 40. But it's really not a huge difference between the two. What's he sending out? I think he sent a grammar. I'm going to go in here. Try and, try and even up our levels as we go. Act 8! I'm about to change, uh, I'm about to change Von Alvarez's nickname to, uh... 
Mag 8, mag, yeah, Mag 8. Because he always hits that magnitude. Oh, there's wild Pokemon here. What can we find here? They are level 34, though, so that's, I mean, that's cool. Why would you not let me escape? No, stop. I hate that. Why would you not let me escape? All right, I'm just going to go back real quick. I hope there's not a gym battle today. I don't want to... I, I want to get everybody to at least level 40 before our next gym. Like, that's a definite. I absolutely want to be level 40 before next gym battle. With everybody. So, I might be able to do that grinding. Um, today is... I don't want to break the fourth wall too much, but today is Friday. Uh, I might have time on... Well, it depends on when I decide not to work. The great thing about my work situation right now is that if I decide to work, I, I can pretty much work. Um, but I can't work today or I hit overtime and they won't let me do that. Hiya! You're gonna swing at me? I have 20 years of Taekwondo. You probably don't want to do that. If I could give you a recommendation on how to live your life, would not recommend fighting me, of all people. Shiny Trash is proving, proving, Bulbapedia, man, I pull up Bulbapedia and I just leave it there and like, it reloads, even on my phone. That should not be happening on my phone. Like on my computer, I get it. On my phone, that should not be happening. I don't know. Not sponsored by what, whoever this water bottle is. Not sponsored. How'd that steadfast work out for you? Bye, guy. Mercedes is coming along nice. Alright, so we are, we have made it to Apophil Academy. I believe we need to go south. But I'm gonna heal and, uh, actually, hold on. first thing I'm gonna. I feel like I remember this. A little bit. It's so sad seeing what everyone in the city has done to the lake. I heard that a long time ago there used to be all sorts of cute Pokemon in it. Have you ever seen a love disc? They used to swim around as urine, but you never see them anymore. Hey, if you ever find a lug disc, would you trade it to me? It would mean a lot to me and have some keys. I'll give you this Darumaka in return. I can't use Darumaka. Crap. Okay, that's fine. Well, maybe I could. You know what? Maybe I could. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Meditating is difficult. I can feel that. I'm not good at just sitting still. I'm not good at it, man. Like I said, I've... Over the last... Oh my god! Take the step forward! Nothing makes me more angry than having to move one step in this video. Nothing. Nothing makes me as angry as moving a single step in this... My guy, let's freaking go. LFG. Why do I have so much money? I'm fine. Um. Oh, whoa, I just remembered parts of this game. I can't wait until the next class. Kiki is a great teacher. Isn't this a lovely little building? Kiki takes care of everything here. This building is a perfect retreat in between ho long hikes. I couldn't live without it. Awful Academy is like an oasis in the desert of Reborn's chaos. It's like a protective aura keeps all the problems of the outside world away from this. 
I must sharpen my mind to sharpen my strength. Balance of mind and body. Come, learn with me. The body and mind are two very powerful tools. Yet so often do many people focus on uh, too much one or the other. They neglect to keep the balance. Remember that everything in the internal world is reflected on the external world. To lose balance within yourself is to lose is to lose the balance of life. The mind and the body are two halves of the same coin. They must work together and be strengthened together. Too often do people flip the coin hoping that it may land on the side of their choosing. However, this is a needless gamble. When you strengthen both the body and mind, no matter which side the coin may land on, you will still be strong. I feel motivated. I feel motivated. I'm not sure if any book can be as interesting as TV these days. I don't watch TV. Straight up, I don't watch TV. Alright, here we go. For trainers, many emotions can be attached to the outcome of battle. Joy, disappointment, excitement, relief, embarrassment. Truly, the tumult of combat is scroll. Oh, man, I didn't mean to click A. However, in that chaos, many people lose sight of what it is that really matters. The moment a battle concludes, it ceases to be meaningful in itself. For combat, for combat itself, what is important is the coming war. As such, the purposes of the previous fight's results are often distorted by emotion. When many fights may be exciting, but it also spells impen the impending loss. On the other hand, to lose is a blessing. A loss becomes an opportunity for growth. And of course, personal growth will propel you further and higher into life than you could ever imagine. Remember, always learn from your losses. Because if, if you're able to do so, then you have secured an even greater victory. This game is going off right now. Like, these are some real... Every day I'm becoming a better and stronger version of myself. With each step I take, I draw closer to my purpose in this world. You too must do the same. Study, learn, grow. When you reach Zen, come again and you will surely be rewarded. You know what? This game... I'm trying to move to the Apophil Academy. This game is, like, this is awesome. The things that this that this area is saying, they're so real. It's so real. All of the stuff that it's saying. Like, I'm not trying to be joking or anything like that. The stuff that this game is saying right now is real. Victoria's been gone for a while. What's with her? Unless it's something to do with him. Wait a minute. Victoria's not into me? Okay, I need to get better at this. How to meditate. Want to study, buddy? Hmm. Meditation is simply the arts of clearing your head of thoughts. Although this sounds simple, it can be very difficult for the unpracticed. To begin, play calming music or find a quiet place, or place with, this, with other natural rhythm, for instance, the rhythm of waves dancing on the beach. Find a, oh, sorry. Find a comfortable seated position and close your eyes, and simply think about nothing. When you first try this, you will quickly realize how difficult it is for you to stop thinking. Thoughts will drift in and out of despair in and out despite your efforts. This is normal. But each time you find yourself thinking again, force yourself to return to a blank state. For beginners, it is also something helpful to insist to instead only think about the rhythm of one's breath. In this way, you can continue on, clearing your head and practicing keeping it clear for as long as you wish to meditate. Alright, one more study person. A brief review of energy. Does that sound interesting? Energy exists in many forms, but it is seldom adequately appreciated. One form of energy that is often neglected is that is that uh, is that that ex is that that exists not as power or potential, but as the very spirit of being. When you form a fist and strike, you're transferring energy. The energy transfers through your body. If you strike a target, it transfers into the target, damaging it. This is commonly understood. But consider the ah, oh, come on, something something. Do not strike a target. What happens to it? In answer, the energy still transfers even if a target is not struck. The very action of punching itself carries a force which is understood universally. Even if you do not punch someone so so much, even if you do not punch someone so much as at punch at them, some part of them will still feel the impact in the punch's energy. It may not manifest as physical pain or damage, but the energy will continue to flow as it always does. There's a guy who's come here recently, pretty odd fellow. He's, keep, he's, keep, he's quiet and keeps to himself, but really stands out. I know he attends every lecture, but I've never seen him fight. I think he went to train at the volcano. 
That's exactly what I remember. No, not another one. All right, cool. Let's read it. Have you met Cal? It's kind of weird, but kind of cool. And by that, I mean kind of hot. Oh, well, don't tell Victoria I said that. I mainly come here to hike, but I never miss a chance to listen to Kiki's lectures. She's a, she's a sage, that girl. It's the main lecture hall, but we do a lot of classes outside, too. Or by the water, or on Pyrus Mountain, or in the training ground. It's like there's a field trip every day. This is Kiki's room, but she's out at the moment. Oh, you're looking for her? Hmm, well, she went down to teach a class in the training ground, so you should probably try and catch, a, catch her after the lecture. They're basically right out the front door. You can't miss them. <laughs> Domino? Oh, you're coming from Apophil Academy? Kiki's school is going strong, and it's established so much technique and positive energy around there that her meditation ability is out of this world. When she uses Meditate, her Pokemon will be, will be much, much stronger than normal. Don't give her that chance. By the way, for beating the fighting type, although many people go for flying types, that could be a risky play. With all the sand and ash down there, it's easy for it to get kicked up and vision to be lost. But Kiki's mentality or mentally focused Pokemon will often land attacks. Rather than flying types, try using the mental energy against her. Psychic types can really do a number down there. Oh, and one more thing. I said this once before, but Kiki's gym badge also won't raise the level cap. So try not to train too much while you're there. Good luck. Understood, and thank you, AIM. I like AIM. AIM is one of my favorites. Round one, Fado. Oh, okay. Training time. It's me. I feel like Pikachu in that one episode with the punching gloves. Choo, choo, choo. Choo, choo, choo. I know you know what I'm talking about. You try this? Let's try this. Poison. Where's Venoshock? I need Venoshock. Not mud shot. Well, Ripperino, Pepperino. I think we very obviously go into Mirror B here. So level 40 is our goal for when we take on the gym because it's not going to raise any level. Let's go for Absorb to make up for some of the... Oh. Ice Slam is such a good move. Such a good move, man. Hitmonchan, Jesus. Hmm. This could be a little bit of trouble because, like, Mercedes is going to be so used in the. Faint go. I know that Faint goes through. Um, that's bad. I need to be Oko-ing everything. That's bad. But, um... I didn't know that Faint went through Fake Out. I didn't know that at all. Excuse me. Oh my gosh, I'm starving. Okay. So, what I was saying was like, Mercedes is going to be so used. No, real talk. Like, all of the stuff that this... That, that was being said. It, it's so real. It's such a real thing. Like... It was really good. There was, there was some good stuff to read. There's some good stuff to read. That's why I read it all, because it was like, I was feeling it. I was like, yeah, this stuff is, it's real. And if you live with those type of mindsets, like, uh, no, 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 no. I gotta get Shiny Trash to level 38, or level 36, whatever one it is. But, um. Uh, I wonder if there's another Psychic type that we could potentially add to our team temporarily. Alright, let's see how much this does. This is level 35. Okay, took it out. But I'm sure she's going to have a Conkledur. I'm sure that the gym battle is going to be... 
Hey, he said, I have much to learn. We all have much to learn, my guy. Crap! I think I pushed myself too hard, bro. Yo, dude, you don't got any protein, do you? I ran out, but after a sick workout like that, it's just what I need. You got any, give a brother a hand. Sweet! Good bro ate the protein at once. Yo, I heard that Kiki girl lecturing some of the chicks here on uh, on some stuff about this beach. I accidentally picked up a digital copy of the lecture, so let me hook you up, bro. That's what I'm saying. I'll have to look at that before our next episode. We're gonna go ahead and finish these battles. No matter what, I can never seem to pack lightly. Let's see. Two pairs of socks, two jackets, two bags of food, the poncho, stove, tent, sleeping bag, and blankets. What? Three sweaters, two pairs of pants, sandals, and hiking boots, grandma's good luck charm, grandpappy's good luck charm, uncle Steve's good luck charm, camera, lantern, aunt Margaret's necklace, which ain't good, a good luck charm, but I don't got one from her, so we're gonna say it is. My journal, journal, the last four issues of Dragon Tamer Monthly, compass, written utensils, traveling knife, and three changes of undies. That ought, to, that ought to do for about an overnight trip, don't you think? Oh, hey, I don't need this piece. Why don't you take it off of my hands? Are you kidding me? Um, why was he carrying a stove? Why was he carrying a stove? Oh, hello there. I'm a special trainer with a psychic power. People call me the Sage. I have the ability to discern a Pokemon. God dang it. <laughs> I don't know what I thought he was going to do, but I thought he was going to do something more useful than that. Becoming one with your Pokemon or understand the static and dynamic in battle. Okay, uh, let's heal. Yo, Apophil Academy is off the hook. Apophil Academy might be my favorite place that we've seen. This is, this is a really great place. It's all about the grind. It's all about training. Train, 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 train. Kiki is a great sensei. She really helps everyone all the time and never loses her cool. Is that foreshadowing? Is she going to lose her cool? Also, how bad is she going to beat me on a scale of 1 to I need to train? I feel like I need to train. At the same time, I feel like if I train, I'm going to wind up fighting in the next next game. Or in the next episode. Before the gym battle, and I'll wind up going over the level that I wanted. Sweet. Alright, you also have a girder, I would imagine. I feel like I can take this. Minfu is so good in uh, Little Cup competitive. I did not know that. But like watching uh, watching Joey Pokeyame's videos, like Minfu is in like every single team. Mianfu, or however you say his name. Oh, hit level 36. Come on, let's hit level 36. Cool. Alright, so we're definitely going to hit level 36 unless I make a mistake and like stay in when I shouldn't, but Chimchar? Okay. I can handle a Chimchar. What does Chimchar have? Why is Chimchar here? Why am I faster than a Chimchar? Fire spin. Let us heal. Facade, ouch. If I would have poisoned him, would that have killed me? No, 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 no. Oh, that's so annoying. That's extremely annoying. Whatever, let's just fake it. If I wouldn't have missed that, like, Inferno? No. If 
I wouldn't have missed that, I would have grown to level 36. Is that where I evolve? Do I evolve at level 36? Uh... Find out. Rubbish evolves. Oh my gosh, that's in. Heck. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. We can. We'll, we'll fix this. We'll fix this. The moment that we've been waiting for for quite a long time. We will not be denied to another episode. I'm gonna have to find a wild Pokemon. That's absolute. Ooh. Okay, that's a good item to find. I feel like that's put there, obviously because of where we're at, but like also because you might not ever check these, because you might not realize it's so nice to just be away from the city and relax. You know what? I almost, I like, I feel the same, but like, I love working and all the work that I do, but it feels great to have a day off. Wait. If you see a TV laying around anywhere near here, bring it to me. Hold on. I'm curious, like, is she talking about... Oh, cool. Nature Girl Casey is apparently really mad. Why do you have a level 38? I am starving. If you ever... When did I learn Discharge? Was that there in the last episode? Yes. Please learn Toxic. I've, I never use Takedown, and I don't think I ever will. I hate that move. Guillotine, aren't you? Holy cow. We are getting smacked up right now. Why is she so mad? A binnacle? Why is she so angry? Holy cow. Why do you have these Pokemon so high leveled? Holy cow. It's nuts. It's nutty. Alright. Engine power. You're probably gonna get the boost. Okay. I, I honestly, honestly, I expected her to get the boost. Hammer up. Yeah, I'll switch. Jeez, I feel like I need to apologize. Yeah, Blastburn... Blastburn's kinda strong. My precious TV is slipping away! Oh, it's, I forgot about this! Finally! The day we've been waiting for for so freaking long. A useful, hopefully, Garbodor. Well, I do now if you take the TV. Work? Why do you do this to me, huh? Another girl asked you to get it for her dorm. That girl almost sounds like my roommate. 
Meaning that TV would be going to my dorm as well. I never saw you. We never battled. You were never here. Take the TV and go, quickly. What if I talk to somebody else and I have this TV in my pocket? I wonder if that would be like, I wonder if somebody would be like, why are you carrying a TV? Actually, never mind. I'm not, I'm not, cur I'm not curious about that at all. Oh my god, you actually did it. You actually brought me a TV. You just picked up the whole freaking TV and just carried it down here? Who does that? I don't know, but you rock. Quick, set it down over there. We'll pretend it was here the whole time. I didn't think you'd actually do it. This is so cool. I hope I don't get in trouble. I'll just blame you if I do, okay? In return, you can have this. This is for Obsidian's department store, but I never go there anymore. I did all that for a sticker. I don't have for a freaking sticker. I don't have for a freaking sticker. My Pokemon got abused for a freaking sticker. Tiny trash. With some terrible, terrible stats. Okay. Um why is his attack that much higher? Even though he's in a beneficial... What the heck? What is... Hold on. Let's look at Garbodor's moveset. Gunk Shot is physical. I could go back and teach Body Slam. Alright, well, we're gonna go ahead and call it an episode there. Today's episode, we got to explore the amazing Apophil Academy. I, lo I love this area. I think all of the stuff he was saying in this game about mindset and mind-body like balance, I think it's all so real. But if you enjoyed today's episode, make sure you hit the like button down below. Do subscribe if you're new and comment what your favorite thing about this episode was. And we'll see you in the next episode of Pokemon Reborn. Until then, have a blessed day.